What is up guys, it is Eddie 100 here and today I am at Lamborghini of Manhattan. You can see there is an Aventador right here. Pretty insane looking car. Over here is a Huracan. It looks like a different type of Huracan. Oh, this is the Performante. That's what they call it. So I'll give you a closer look at this car and the event. <laughs> Over here is another yellow Aventador. Huracan Spider. A Huracan LP580. Then another Huracan Spider. Wow. So this one's actually a Pirelli edition. It, the difference between this and the regular Aventador Roadster is that there's an addition of stripes and it has a nicer interior. Um, the, difference, the difference in the uh, interior is the carbon fiber on the uh, center console and that the seats say Pirelli on it. I'll show you that. See carbon fiber on the door handles, on the center console. See it says Pirelli on the seats. Then it also has a black uh, cover on the engine. And then the back, it also features those red stripes. Then it's pretty nice how they put the wing on. Mm -hmm. Here's the Huracan Spider. So the LP580, uh, the difference between this one and the normal Huracan is that this one is actually rear wheel drive. It's not four wheel drive like this one. It also, the back of it, uh, the back is a little different. And also the front grills over here are different. If you see on the normal Huracan, that's what the grills look like. And then on the, uh, the back of it, you see, a little different. One of my favorite parts about this car are the P0 wheels with the stripe around it. She says Pirelli right there. And also this massive intake. I've never seen another car with an intake that big. I think the the engine cover should have just been kept in the original the color of the car. Now if you noticed the bumper on this is higher than usual. Why? Um, it's actually a very smart idea by Lamborghini. What they did was, because the cars are so low to the ground, there's a button inside the car that you push, and then the bumper uh, raises up so you don't like scrape the, the bumper when you come in. Like, for example, when the car needed to get in here, they raised it because it would have been scraped over here. But you can see the grills are removed on this one. I think this is like a, uh, yeah, it is a professional racing car. In person, this is actually like the interior is so much cooler in person. It's, it's just amazing. These, by the way, if you didn't know, with convertible Lamborghinis, they are removed manually. 
meaning you don't push a button and then it just comes off. You, there's like a, a red thing back there, you pull that up, it comes off, and then you store it in the trunk. And that's how to do it, then you do it with the other one. Um, see this carbon fiber over here too. that exhaust is unlike other cars like for example the Huracan you could see the exhaust pipe is it's on both sides here it's just like four exhausts jammed into one which is pretty crazy So I stopped by at Audi to uh, take a look at the new R8 V10. Um, it has the same engine as the Lamborghini Huracan, very similar, except it doesn't look the same. <laughs> now, if you were to ask me, I'd prefer this Audi because, I mean, this one, it's nice, but like, this one's much better in my opinion. Like the V10, what I don't like about the V10 is that they uh, they made this grill too big here. But you can see there's a lot of carbon fiber inside. Um, it's the convertible one. So when the roof is down, the car looks more flat, sort of like the Huracan Spider. Um, so one of the guys just told me that there are more cars upstairs, so I'll go look at those. So over here is the R8 V10, convertible. So this one, in my opinion, looks much better than the coupe. Let me show you around a bit. Over here, it's all carbon fiber. I'll do that again since you got in. This one, so this car has 600, around 600 horsepower, 605. It is almost as fast as the Audi R8. And it looks beautiful. It features a lot of carbon fiber. The, the interior is also has nice carbon fiber. See the exhausts are loud. So here's the V8 engine with some carbon fiber accents. Um, and yeah, it looks beautiful. So here's another R8 V10. I like this color better than the other one. The exhausts are very big. Even bigger than the Lamborghini Huracan's exhaust. There's the V10 engine. Uh, I don't know how much horsepower. But I'm guessing around my 500. I8. It is an electric car. It um, it's not that fast. I think it has a top speed of around like 160 or 180, but it does look very aggressive. It has the uh, the wing doors, and over there is the charger. And that wraps it up for today's video. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. 
for more videos. Peace.